input their score into that tablet and it's revealed at the end of the kata performance and the player with the highest score overall wins the match so here we go world champion Sandra Sanchez going for her 11th Karate One Premier League win Once again, as she did in the World Championship final, showing that amazing focus of concentration and the speed of those incredible techniques. So, yeah, like you said before, Billy, uh, now we have seven referees giving scores, two different scores, one for the technical aspect and one for the athletic aspect. And of that technical aspect, the scores are entered and 70% is loaded in favor of technical performance against 30% on athletic performance. And as kata is a very technical discipline, brilliant height. The rehearsal you see in the background of Kyoshimizu going through that kata, getting ready to come out to perform. Sanchez is really trying here to impress those judges to keep her position at the top of the tree. Yeah, I think the feeling and, and, and uh, the power you had to. Imp to put into the kata now uh, is very important because the referees are not so close as they used to be in the mat where are you performing yes that, that energy has has got to be radiated out to the judges who will now following the bow that completes the kata the judges will now input their scores. You'll hear a beep and the score will be revealed at the bottom of your screen. As soon as it's been confirmed. Anticipation. Waiting. What is the score to be? And it is, as you see, 25.2. 25.2 is the score that Kyoshimizu has to try to beat. So you saw in the screen um, two, two separate scores that at the end they, they add up and give the, the, the final 25.2, but uh, it was separate in uh, technical and, and athletic. athletic yeah. Olympic standing, first place, Kyoshimizu, former double world champion, Chibana no Kushanku. So yeah, she means changing the strategy from the it's World Championship. Beautiful, beautiful kata. Really well performed here. As you see, the focus has changed, as you say. That's quite a 
a shift from November to be able to perfect the catter and perform it here. Excellent. Another great jump. Really impressive height. Also, the seven referees have the same vision now. They are from the same angle. Yes, the, the perception, rather than the four corners. And then you, in those situations, the judge in one of the corners may see something different and then change their decision from a red to a blue. But here, everybody is looking at the cutter from the same angle. Look at the determination on her face. And again, the power of the Kiai. This is going to be really interesting to see how the scores pan out. Here. Yeah, we have to remember that um, the two highest scores and the two lowest scores go out. On the board, when you see the scoreboard, the red scores don't count, the white scores do. 25.2 is the score she needs to beat. As the judges have put in their wow. decision. Oh, 26.14. 26.14. But I have to say, what a fantastic performance. 26.14 gives her the gold medal. And she has beaten the current world champion what a clash this is going to be over the next coming year or so in the lead up to the olympics and, and antonio these two guys these two fantastic athletes could well be contesting the olympic we could be